said, but the point is, conversion begins immediately. If I were to take a, a, a refractometer reading right now, for example, you'd see probably 124, 126, something like that, which means it's already banging away. It's already converting. And as the temperature decreases over a period of time, conversion increases. So once we get to a half hour, for example, if we use two degrees in an hour, we've only lost one degree in 60 minutes, I mean in 30 minutes. So the point is, you're converting and temp is dropping at the same time, but to such, to such a small degree that it's inconsequential to the actual results. So when we get to the end of 60 minutes, if we've lost two degrees, the majority of the mash is converted at 75%, let's say, in 30 minutes. You've only lost one degree in 30 minutes, which means you're still in the zone. You're still in that conversion zone that you wanted to be. So there's no need to worry about flaming on. I just covered this thing up completely. I insulated it with duct wrap, which you can buy at Home Depot for around $16, cut it to size, tape it with some aluminum tape, put the pillow thing on top, you saw me do that, cover it with this moving blanket, and I'll almost guarantee it will be two degrees or less when we're done mashing, as far as the loss is concerned. 